Pectus excavatum is a relatively common congenital deformity of the chest wall. It happens in boys and girls, and it becomes more noticeable as they get older, usually during teenage years, when they go through their rapid growth spurt. Pectus excavatum is relatively common. We see it occur in roughly one in every 400 to 500 people. Here at Mount Sinai, we have a multidisciplinary team that helps take care of people with chest wall deformities. Our team approach includes thoracic surgeons, pediatric surgeons, plastic surgeons, and many other different experts that help us take care of people with chest wall deformities. The most common surgical repair for pectus excavatum is called the NUS procedure, which is a minimally invasive operation to repair the chest wall. Here at Mount Sinai, we have pioneered the use of the NUS procedure for the repair of pectus excavatum in teenagers and adults. One of the reasons that I specialize in treating people with pectus excavatum is because it offers the opportunity to really restore someone to full function and a normal life. I'm Brian Reyes, I'm 21, and I'm a full-time student at Queens College. When I first realized I had pectus, I was going into high school, eighth grade, ninth grade, and my brothers and friends would tell me I'll have a, my dent was, my chest was like denting in, and then I would start getting like chest pains. When I found out I was going to have surgery, I did as much research as possible, like people's experiences, how I was afterwards. I was really nervous, but the day of, I was even more nervous. When I woke up from after surgery, it was I felt nothing. It was easy. From the first time we met Brian, we really had a very strong connection. Uh, when I saw him and I heard about his difficulties in school with his appearance and his inability to play sports, you know, I thought of my own uh, childhood and adolescence and I think about my kids and what it must be like for these people uh, to have to grow up with this sort of problem. We were very happy that we could offer a minimally invasive surgery to Brian and that we had such excellent results. We're very happy that he's returned to a completely normal life and is very happy with the way his chest looks now. 